comes the Bonnie Bell. Late arrival. Hello, hello. What site are we? 86. All right, howdy folks. Here we are at Devil's Den in the Wonder Lodge. We got here yesterday, midday, and uh, we're actually just finished setting up camp, getting everything set up. So Sherry's uh, preparing some, what are you preparing? Chicken salad. I'm selling real estate off my cell phone and making chicken salad at Devil's Den. Tell us about Wi-Fi, what's new? Um, they, I talked to the uh, check-in and they've done some boosters around the park too. It looks like it's and, satellite. And she didn't mention satellite. It's because it, I read about it, it's called Viasat. So it, it is part of what they're doing for she the... Seemed, she seemed surprised that I was able to get um, phone calls down here through my uh, cellular Wi-Fi, but I said, yeah. yeah, I'm getting phone calls. Yeah, we have our Wi-Fi calling mode on, and we've been made, able to make calls. It's been awesome. Well, I'm going to go outside and show the rig and the, on, uh, the new big awning that we've yet to pull out for the last year. We finally got it all out and now know how to do that right. And so, not much else doing here. Yep, so there's the the big awning out. So we had all that done when we had all the new fabric put on with the little awnings too. But uh, believe it or not, it's been a year almost since we did that. And this is the first time we actually took the time to pull the awning out. Uh, and actually learned how to do it right with all the extending and support. Uh, I didn't actually know how to do that when I first bought this, but now I do and I have a couple of poles to work with to do it it's really a two-person job i don't know i struggle to understand how one person would do that but uh so that's uh that's that of course we uh had upgraded everything when we bought this and did the renovation and got it painted and we bought all black and silver stuff so the rug the chairs over there um gramps is over there and then the cooking setup, this this works really good. These little fold up black tables. Uh, you know, I've got a splitter off the propane under here and uh, two way. But yeah, this little griddle by uh, Greystone does a pretty good job. It's just got to keep on top of it, keep it clean. I mean, you know, this stuff can kind of rust a little bit. And this three burner by Camp Chef, the Ranger 3. We had a Ranger 2 once, but having a third burner and extra space really works great. So let's check out our little seating area. And again, we're at Devil's Den State Park, just outside of Fayetteville, Arkansas. And we've got Gramps over here. I thought he might be trying to take a nap on me there for a second. Well, I could. Help your photography. Yeah. He, uh, he loves his naps. And of course, Gramps' rig is the 1990 Toyota Seabreeze over there. And uh, around us, well, let's see, around us, uh, it's filling up pretty good. There's a few spots open, it looks like. Normally this is full for Labor Day weekend and Memorial weekend, too. We usually come out here, we've always come here uh, for Labor Day, but as we go around, there's the entrance. There's a vehicle backing up there. That's the entrance to this campground E that we're in. And then, uh, so we just looped around in front of us all the way around the back and that's one loop uh, there's another loop looks like where that car is going so there's another loop that loops around that way and there's a you know a lot of rigs down there there's a softball field straight ahead back in the back there and they do uh, a softball it's a tradition down here to do softball game Saturday and Sunday at four o'clock and basically everybody from the park that wants to play goes down there and uh, we used to do it I haven't done it in a couple years I got uh, I'd like to do it again, but uh, we'll see. But anyway, it's really beautiful. A lot of trees, lots of good shade. There's a breeze in here today. There's a few flies. Uh, of course, you can burn campfires down in here. True campground. And uh, just, just a really always a fun family gathering this time of year. And uh, our families and, uh, and our neighbors and all their friends and family, we, we used to be a pretty big... Uh, group that would come down here for Labor Day and uh, the kids when they were younger of course grew up playing together here and uh, a lot of great trails and things to see actually all around us here a lot of great trails so anyway that's uh, that's it for that 
Hanson, come here. Come here. Come here. You're on video. All right, what is Hanson? What kind of doodle? Burn a doodle, burn a doodle. And what's, what's burn a doodle mean? Oh, really? Okay, we're on our way home from our annual Labor Day weekend trip to Devil's Den State Park here south of Fayetteville in our home state of Arkansas. Welcome back to Woody's channel. It's Scott making the drive home. Scott, you want to talk about our trip? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. We just uh, got out of the hills of the Devil's Den area, so we're uh... <laughs> I gotta start the game. <laughs> I dropped the camera. I... All right, we are on our way home from our annual Labor Day weekend trip to Devil's Den State Park, just south of Fayetteville, Arkansas, close to home for us. Welcome back to Woody's Corner. Scott is making the drive home. Yeah, I think we had a really good weekend. And uh, the Wander Lodge behaved. No issues whatsoever. So, you know, we're always happy for that. And uh, it was a good trip. We had a little bit of rain when we arrived Friday and um, a downpour last night. Had to go hide from. But other than that, the weather was really nice. And, uh, you know, we've got the Branson Vintage Camper Rally trip coming up in a couple days. So we'll, we'll turn right around and leave on uh, Thursday and head up for that for another weekend. So this is kind of our busy camping time right now, and we always enjoy this. But uh, yeah, uh, you know the park. I think we mentioned in some other parts of the video that we had, you know, they installed satellite, so they had satellite Wi-Fi, and so it was really good. We had phone service, we had Wi-Fi calling on our phones, you know, and uh, able to keep up with everything. And so it just made it. Of course, that's a real important thing to have. So, so yeah, Devil's Den is still high on our list as far as you know going there we love the other and that made it even better uh, i don't really have much else to say what about you i uh, know we always enjoy the park um these sites compared to other campgrounds that we go to are just unmatchable um, sites are big and and wooded lots of shade plenty of room lots of uh, trees put the hammocks up and really just one of our very favorite parks and we are so lucky that it is so close to home for us just about an hour away so need to make an effort to uh, make more trips down to Devil's Den State Park. And, and you do, if you do uh, go there you do have to book early especially yes. on a holiday. It's yes. really hard to get on the list and get in. When we check when we go in to check in at the camp office we book for the following year so that we know we've got sites reserved but yeah for uh, holiday weekends really need to book far in advance all right i think that's it